Hi there, I'm Michael with eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a quick look at this Kodiak 13 inch hub and rotor disc brake assembly set. This is going to allow you to upgrade your trailer from drum brakes to disc brakes so that you can experience the superior performance that comes along with having disc brakes on your trailer. Uh, so we do have the two brake assemblies here that will allow you to upgrade a single 7,000 pound capacity axle with the number 42 spindles. Our rotors here are 13 inches in diameter. And as you can see, we have eight of these 5 8 inch diameter wheel bolts in that eight on six and a half inch bolt pattern. So these will work for your wheels that are 16 inches and larger. Our calipers and our caliper mounting brackets uh, both have an e-coat that's gonna help resist rust and corrosion with a 250 to 350 hour salt spray rating. Uh, so these are gonna uh, provide adequate rust protection for your uh, campers, car haulers, or utility type trailers. If you are wanting to upgrade uh, a boat trailer or a trailer that's going to be coming in contact with a lot of road salts and that sort of thing, I would recommend more of a uh, dichromate finish or a stainless steel construction. Those are going to be a little bit higher quality, so they are going to cost a little bit more, uh, but they're going to hold up better in those sort of environments. But if your trailer is not going to be in those kind of situations, these are going to hold up really well for you and do a good job for a long time to come. So. Upgrading your trailer from drum brakes to disc brakes is going to have several different benefits as far as performance goes. It's going to dramatically shorten your stopping distance, and it's also going to make your braking uh, much more smooth and controlled, so you're not going to get that push-pull feeling that you're used to with your drum brakes. These do use ceramic brake pads uh, that are going to increase the stopping power, and you can't really see it, but there is a large two and a half inch diameter stainless steel piston here that provides fast responsive braking so definitely an improvement as far as performance goes and it's also going to require less maintenance than your drum brake so it is going to help save you time and money over the long run having the one piece hub and rotor assembly is going to reduce the chance of uneven rotor wear and then here on the side you can see we do have this vented design that's going to help dissipate heat faster to prevent premature brake pad wear. These are a high quality automotive grade construction, so they are going to last. Again, as long as you're using them in the right environments, uh, they will last for you and do a good job. Um, one caveat with disc brakes is that they do require a higher line pressure than your drum brakes. So you're going to need to make sure that you've got a hydraulic brake actuator and brake lines that are rated for 1500 PSI or higher in order to activate your brakes. Uh, that's kind of rare for trailers that are already set up for drum brakes. So it might be a project having to switch things out. We do have the hydraulic brake actuators and the brake lines available here at eTrailer.com. Uh, they are sold separately. So this kit isn't going to include everything that you need, uh, but it is going to include these two iron hub and rotor assemblies with the eight five eighths inch diameter pre-installed wheel bolts on each. You also get 16 of these five eighths inch zinc plated steel lug nuts to make sure that your wheels stay in place. We've got our two E-coated cast iron calipers and our E-coated ductile iron caliper mounting brackets. As you can see with these, uh, they are going to have that five bolt brake flange configuration. So it is gonna be very easy to get these mounted on your axle. I do wanna point out, I've got these mounted on top just for display purposes, for balance and whatnot. When you install them, they're actually gonna be mounted on the side. That side support design puts all the weight on the mounting bracket instead of on your bolts. So it's gonna help your bolts last longer. You are gonna get four of these stainless steel caliper mounting bolts with this kit. Our inner and our outer races are also included uh, and they're pre-installed there. We've got our inner and outer bearings that will fit into those races once you get them packed. Um, it's gonna make sure that everything's moving smoothly. Uh, this system is lubricated with grease. So we've got our two grease seals for the inside and our uh, Easy Lube grease caps. These do have the removable rubber plug there so uh, you can simply pop that out hook up your grease gum pump some grease in there in between your uh, normal maintenance to get repack the bearings and make sure that you're got plenty of grease in there so everything's moving smoothly for you so like i said uh, this is going to be a great upgrade over your drum brakes it is going to take a little bit of work to uh, 
put in those lines and a new hydraulic brake actuator and that sort of thing, but I think it's going to be worth it for you. I think you'll be very impressed with the performance of the disc brakes on your trailer. And uh, the, having that e-coat finish on here is going to make sure that these last uh, a long time for you, especially in those environments, like I said. And again, if you are going to be in more of salty environments, I would recommend some of those other finishes. We do have other kits available with those other quality uh, finishes and that sort of thing. So just make sure you're getting the right one for your setup. That completes our look for today. Again, I'm Michael with eTrailer.com. Thanks for watching.